you here with senior nationals champion Alex Galaude just finished up her uh, best of three series. Um, hey, how do you, how do you feel out there today? Obviously, you were able to win your bouts and come home as champ. Yeah, I feel really good. I mean, all considering, I didn't really get what I wanted at trials, which um, it was a learning experience, and I'm, you know, just grateful that I even got to compete at such a high level. And uh, I'm proud of my performance today. I mean, I'm not satisfied, but you know, got a lot going on. I just moved to Oregon and still making some adjustments, but. I'm overall happy, I feel good. Now, most years you get one shot at a big event and, and then you're done. This year there's a world championships. Yeah. Uh, what's that like for you? I mean, obviously you had to like refocus quickly to yeah. start looking at a, at a new goal, right? Yeah. Um, I mean, I feel pretty good going into it. I mean, leading up to this tournament, I took a week long road trip with my mom. And I'm the kind of person where I tend to do better when I don't think about wrestling. So I think um, I'm just not going to put any pressure on myself. I mean, I love this sport and it's a lot of fun, so I'm just going to treat it that way. Like, it's not a big deal. Why the decision to move out to Corvallis? Uh, you know, I was in uh, the Midwest for a while. I went out to McKendree for college, and then once Olympic trials was postponed, I wasn't sure where to go, so I went back with Coach Sam and the girls there. And it was a great experience, but, you know, eventually you have to move on. And, um, take your wrestling to the next level and honestly I wanted to be closer to home too so um, I get a great vibe from the coaches at the dam and coach Nate Pendleton they're awesome and really positive so uh, it's just good it's just a new step in my career that's all so uh, after this tournament obviously you decided to wrestle a few weeks you'd already qualified for the, the world team draws you didn't yeah. have to be here right yeah so why wrestle now I mean obviously a good match is a good match right yeah, I mean, I wanted to go to Pan Ams. I've never been to Pan Ams before, and so when I heard that you could go if you won the non-Olympic weight, then I was all for it. And also, today's my birthday, so. Well, how about that? <laughs> my <laughs> gosh, that's. Have you ever won a national title on your birthday before? No, no I'm just checking stuff off my bucket list. <laughs> <laughs> so talk about. Uh, you know, the, what the journey's been like during the COVID. I mean, it's, it's we're trying to get out of it. You're wrestling, we've been able to wrestle, right? But a lot of changes, a lot of challenges. What kind of things have you learned and what kind of things have you experienced with this? Mm, I mean, I think everyone's experience, you know, is different. And fortunately, I'm grateful that nothing severe happened to me during this time. And I think it really just forced me to refocus and pay attention to why I actually love wrestling because I mean if you can't wrestle for three four months um, sometimes there's that temptation to oh, do I really want to do it do I want to get back down to weight do I want to work that hard and um, so it was a good time to just focus on other things and reevaluate my goals and now I'm back I think I'm different than I was last year same values same goal but just different approach now were you disappointed that there was only one person other than you in the weight class? Um, a little bit, yeah. I mean, I just think it's fun to be able to see how you stack up against different people. And, you know, not everyone wrestles the same. So what works on one person won't work on somebody else. And, yeah, so, I mean, it's okay. I still got to compete, and I'm grateful for that. Do you like 72 kilos? Not cutting weight is nice. <laughs> um, but I don't think I'll stay at 72. Do you still blow with Glade? Uh, yes, just in a different way. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, congratulations you. on your Thank success you. today. And, you know, obviously we're back in the training, new, new opportunities out in Oregon, but, you know, there's something to point towards for you, right? Yeah, I mean, there's it a should lot be a <laughs> pretty busy summer now, right? Yeah, I'm excited for that. I mean, we didn't get to do anything all year, so why not be busy this summer? <laughs> That's awesome. Thanks, Alex. Thank you, guys. Bye-bye. Right,